you doing? Oh, you're really close. Piper. Back up. Hold on. Piper. 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 Hi. Say hey, hi. Hi. <laughs> hi, guys. Happy Friday. It's Friday. I thought I would do a day in the live video um, for you guys because I haven't done one of those in a long time. Hopefully it's not too boring, but I just woke up, actually slept until almost 7 o'clock, which is absolutely insane. I have my um, coffee. It's got um, some almond milk creamer in here, vanilla almond milk creamer and some heavy whipping cream and some stevia. <sighs> There's the kitty and the puppy okay so last night we went out to a friend's house and had dinner and went swimming and um they you know i don't like to be picky when i go out to someone's house and they're cooking for me and i'm like hey i don't eat this i don't eat that so i just ate you know what they what they made and i had i they made pasta i didn't have the pasta i just had the salad and some chicken and some fruit salad and then um, they did make dessert, which I really felt bad for not eating because, you know, sometimes you just got to do what you got to do. So it was angel food cake with strawberries and homemade whipped cream. And it was delicious. But this morning I feel like so lethargic and I just don't feel great. And I know it's because I had some crap to eat. Anyway, so I am planning on sticking very strict today to keto, low carb, um, and I might even kind of try to fast until lunchtime, like, I mean, have my coffee, but not eat anything till lunch because I'm um, trying to get my body back into the swing of things, so um, it's always fun to splurge, and it's totally fine to splurge and eat some stuff that you love that may not be on your diet plan or whatever, but, you know, then you got to get back on track, and um, you got to kind of, you know, get through the consequences of doing that, so that's what I'm doing this morning, but we have some errands to run today, some bills to pay, um, we got to go shopping for our birthday tomorrow, um... Laundry, cleaning, the huge. So anyway, all right. I'll talk to you guys in a little bit, and we'll get our day started. Okay, bye. Piper, that's not your toy. You're going to get in trouble. No, it's cross-training day today. Um, so I'm training for a my next marathon, which is in December. I'm still a ways out, but um, I have some serious personal records I want to break, so I'm working hard. Um, so today is cross training. So I am not a beach body coach, but I have Beach Body on Demand, and I absolutely love their programs, and they are amazing. I used to be a beach body coach um, for about a year, and I did lose 25 pounds doing a T25 back in the day, and I know these programs work, and they are amazing. And with Beach Body on Demand, you have access to all of their programs, like just hundreds of you know programs, tons of stuff. Um, so, I mean everything, all their new programs, Core to Force, Twenty One Day Fix, all their old older stuff. Um, you even have a cooking show, Sean Week. I haven't tried it really. I've done Insanity Max Thirty, amazing, um, Country Heat, Body Beast, everything. So it's uh, ninety nine dollars a year. Um, they have an amazing deal. Uh, anyway, I'll drop the link to uh, On Demand if you guys want to check it out. Um, it's, it's really cool if you have young kids because, um, you know, I can't always get to the gym with my kids or find a sitter. So being able to work out in my home and still get great results is, um, you know, awesome. So uh, what I do is I stream it to my TV. I'll show you how I do it. Um, so this little button right here, up in the corner there, it's not focusing. Focus. Okay, anyway, there's a little button in the corner there. And so I click on that, click on that, and then it picks up my Wi-Fi. So, and I just click on my Wi-Fi there, 
and then it's gonna pop up on my TV here beach body on demand there you go so pretty cool pretty cool so I've been doing the program I'm doing right now is um, 80 day obsession it's their new program I did do a little obsessed twice first and so I do 80 day obsession I don't do it every day of course I just kind of mix it in with my running program and um, it's great for strength training cross training days um, so today I'm going to be doing that um, and I think I'm going to do um, let's see um, I'm going to do a core one today. I want to work on my core today. So I'm going to do, where are we? Total body, well, I think I'm going to do a cardio core today and I might do, it's a shorter one. 36 minutes is the cardio core so I might do a, um, another workout later or go on a walk later. I like to do, you know, about an hour workout. So... What day? I think I'm on week two. Where is it? Cardio, cardio core week day ten. Yeah. So I'm going to just press play, and it'll come up on my screen. Oh, you gotta accept the liability stuff, so you can't sue them if you get hurt. Very important stuff there. All right. So you see it on my iPad, and then it will come up on here, and I'll suck it. There you go. Welcome to cardio. Isn't that cardio cool? So I'm going to pause so it real quick. So yeah, stream into my TV. So I'm going to do this workout. I might fill some, film some of it for you. And then we're going to get ready to go run some errands. So I always like start my day off with a good workout or run. And get my body moving. Alright guys, talk to you in a little bit. Bye. <laughs> We are finally heading out. I'm just pulling out my driveway. It's 9.20 and we are headed to go do our errands. We have like freaking 20 million stops to make. So, and then we're gonna go have lunch at um, my family's restaurant. And um, gonna be a great day. Got my workout in, showered, all cleaned up. Girls are coloring. So it's going to be great. Um, I haven't eaten anything, just had my coffee and I'm feeling pretty hungry at 9.20 um, probably because I did a pretty good workout and my body wants some fuel so we'll probably eat lunch a little earlier probably at like by 11 because um, I'm sure I'm going to be really starving by then. Um, so but I know that um, I can do it. So. Anyways, all right, we'll see you in a little bit. Bye-bye! There are a million different types of Nerf guns. Like, how do you choose? We're going to a birthday party tomorrow for a little boy, and I don't even know. I have two girls, so I have no idea what I'm doing here. Like, what do I get? <laughs> Help me! <laughs> okay, we're going to figure this out. How's your day going? <coughs> How's your day going? <coughs> Where are we? At the restaurant. At Mimi's restaurant? It's our restaurant. Judy's Junction. We've had this place for 18 years, huh? What do you got there? Clam chowder? Hi, 
Hi guys. It is 2.30 in the afternoon. I actually just closed my eyes for a little bit, took a little nap because I, um, we were running around for a few hours running errands all over town and went and had lunch and I was just super tired. So I, me and the girls laid down, they watched the movie. I closed my eyes for a few minutes and then um, I am making some coffee right now to wake myself back up. <laughs> for those of you who know me, I love coffee. Like I could drink coffee all day and not eat food, just drink coffee. And I would do that, like that would be awesome, but I know that's not really good for me, so I don't do that. But Anyway, I probably have coffee in the afternoon most days. And um, when it's really hot outside, I have iced coffee today. I'm feeling some warm coffee. So um, I put a couple packets of stevia in here and I am going to do some heavy whipping cream, probably a tablespoon or two. And then um, I know this isn't the best for you, but I'm gonna do a little sugar-free vanilla creamer I have in my fridge. Normally I do this um, almond milk creamer, vanilla almond milk, natural creamer. It has a little higher carb and it has five carbs. So um, I, you know, I try to not have a ton of this, but um, it's a lot better for you. So I do use that usually. And I think it's better to be healthier than to worry about going over on your carbs a little bit. So, um, so I don't use sugar-free vanilla creamer as often because it has like corn syrup, soybean oil, not the best ingredients in it, but um, I still like it. <laughs> so I'm gonna have some today, but I have it in moderation, okay, y'all? Um, so I'm gonna have some coffee. I did have probably like 10 to 15 almonds when I got up, grabbed a handful of almonds. Um, I don't know why when you wake up from a nap or something, you always seem hungry, like you just wanna eat something. So had some almonds, gonna have some coffee, and I need to do, um, like a mountain of laundry. I have so much laundry to put away. So I've been feeling like really tired today, um, run down. And usually when I start feeling like that, it means that I am working out too much. I'm overtraining. And I've worked out probably every day the past, well, this probably seven days in a row now, intense, you know, intense workouts. And, um, I'm playing soccer right now, so I have two practices a week and games on Sunday, and then I do my long runs on Saturday, so I'm not really giving myself much of a break, and then I, I'm i a waitress a few days a week, so at our restaurant, so I'm, you know, running around a lot there, so I think um, I uh, need to rest a little bit more, so, you know, I was going to do another little jog or walk this afternoon. But I think I'm going to just skip it and take it easy and do some stuff around the house instead because you got to listen to your body and when your body is telling you to rest and when your body is feeling really tired and run down, it's important to listen and not overtrain, not overdo it because then you're going to get injured or you're going to get sick and we don't want that. All right, I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Bye. Fellow moms, are you feeling me right now? This is what I'm going to be doing for the next probably at least hour. Ugh. Lord help me. I was crossing. So I lied. Said I was going to take it easy and here I am out jogging because where'd she go? My puppy, come on, needs to get some energy out. We have a 11 week old German short hair pointer and they are very energetic and they need to be exercised every day. And she hasn't been exercised much today so we are walking around our vineyard, um, jogging slash walking. And uh, <laughs> so it looks like I'm not gonna be resting much today but oh well, I'll just take a hot bath later and put some muscle rub on my muscles and we'll be fine we we got this so anyway okay say bye
I'm going to show you what I'm going to do for our dinner. I chopped up all these veggies, which you saw, and I'm going to put a little bit of garlic. Well, kind of like a lot, but I love garlic. A little bit of that on there. Okay. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna mix it around before I put it in. And then I'm gonna sprinkle a little bit of extra virgin olive oil. Just a little bit, because what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna be um, cutting these chicken breasts and kind of, I'm gonna be stuffing them with cheese and uh, pesto and um, spinach. So I'm going to be cutting those, putting the stuffing in them, and then I have this rack, which I'm gonna put on top of the veggies, and I'm gonna put the chicken on the rack, and the juices from the chicken are gonna go down in the veggies and make it super delish. So you, it's, it's amazing. I love this contraption. I don't even know where I got it, but it's, I don't even know it's called a roasting pan or something, but it is amazing. So that's the veggies. Okay, so there you have it. Um, I forgot to add the marinara, so I went back and added like a, maybe two tablespoons of marinara inside each chicken breast. Um, so we have marinara, mozzarella, spinach, and a little pesto in, in kind of in the chicken breast. So I also added some salt and pepper on top of the chicken. And I think it's gonna cook up real nice. So I have my oven to 350 and I'm going to put this for like probably 30 minutes maybe maybe I'll do 20 and see how it is see if it needs more so I'll let you know guys here's my day thank you guys so much for watching and please subscribe to my channel for more videos and we will see you at the next one all right bye